So here we are again with Paper Mario Master Quest, and we're not going to be finishing up, up Bowser, finishing up, finishing off Bowser yet. Uh, we will leave him alone for right now, because right now I want to do other stuff, I guess tackle some things I haven't tackled yet. I mentioned in the last part there are a few bosses I haven't done. I also haven't fought any of, I haven't fought Wacka at all. I also have the, uh, the new dungeon to do, so... Yeah, there's quite a bit to do, but I think I'm going to start off, and let me just check how many star pieces I have. I have nine, okay. Um, I think we're going to start off by fighting some super bosses. Did I get the star piece here, by the way? I did. I just want to see as far as what I've got here. Now, the super bosses I did is the very last thing in my last run. Uh, and I had a few more badges than I do now. So, yeah, let's see how let's see how these these guys go. And I don't have any life shrooms, so let me go and grab some life shrooms because I'm probably gonna need those. Ooh, you know this is where um where I wish I had the uh, the traveler's parasol because then I could just. Fly over to Starhaven. Well, actually, I have to fly to Bowser's Castle and then fly. But I, in order to get that, I have to do the whole pit, and I'm just not doing that right now. So let's grab a life shroom. Let's grab another life shroom. <clears throat> I have to see how many life shrooms will be good enough for the Boomba King. I mean, this should be fine, I think. Four, five. Let me see. What items can I check? Um, I kind of want all these items, actually, except maybe the Super Shrooms. Right, we're going to put the Super Shroom away, we're going to put the Shooting Star away. Let's see what else I can take with me. Could use the Shooting Stars. Actually, yeah, I may as well use the Shooting Stars on Goomba King and Goomba Bros. You know what? We're gonna put away the super shroom. We're gonna put away. How many lifers do I have? I have five. Uh, twelve. I'm just trying to think. Alright, we're gonna grab the shooting stars again. Okay, so we got three shooting stars. We got healing. We got <clears throat> pretty much everything that we need. I also haven't fought Kensi Koopa yet. And he's a giant pain, so... Yeah. But, um, let's see how these super bosses go. There's a star piece hidden away here, right? There we go. Alright. So, Goomba King. And the Goomba Bros. They are very strong. The Goomba Bros buff the Goomba King. Actually, should I do it in order? Because I did it in, in order last time I played this. In chapter order. Maybe I'll do it in order from what I considered easiest to most difficult in the... In the original run. Now, the easiest one ended up being Huff and Puff, if I remember right. At least I felt like it was the easiest. Um... You could argue Tubba Blubba is easier, though. Tubba Blubba is pretty easy. I might have jumped the gun when I said Huff and Puff was the easiest. But alright, let's start with Huff and Puff. Um, so I don't need Spike Shield. So that's a good thing. Um, uh, let's see. I don't... I don't know if I need Feeling Fine or not. I'm gonna say... No, for right now, but I feel like I probably am gonna need it, so I'm gonna keep it in mind. Um, all or nothing, P up, D down, some defense boosting badges. All right, let's just take off, take off the defense. Um, 
I just don't remember how much damage he does. So, like, I could put on Power Rush and potentially get into danger pretty easily. Although, the whole thing is, if he works like his, um, like his normal boss counterpart, the best way to do this is to let the life streams do their thing, right? Let the rough puffs kill me each turn, and then Huff and Puff doesn't even get a chance to attack. In fact, if I can abuse that, this fight will be a piece of cake. Um, I'm probably going to want some FP, though, so let's, let's put on a couple of those. Uh, is there anything else I'd want in that case? I need to get some rough buffs out there, uh, the very first turn. Alright, we're gonna throw on Power Rush, and... Not Zap Tap. Uh, let's go with... If there's nothing else, I'll probably put on Feeling Fine. I don't want Lucky Day, I don't want to risk, or Close Call. I don't want to risk them not killing me. Um... I don't read feeling fine if it's just the rough puffs attacking me. So, I am thinking... Not double dip. I am thinking... I don't, know, I don't think I need any other batches, really. Um... Yeah, I actually genuinely don't think I need any other badges. I think I've got what I need. I don't want to defend plus on. Uh, it's got a lot of HP. Alright, I guess I'll go... Uh, I don't know. Alright, group focus. Let's throw that on. Actually, let me just make a save. Now that I've set up my badges. Now this, again, this fight crashed a couple times. Um, crashed a couple times when I was playing it before, and also crashed my original run. Actually, someone in the comments pointed out um, for my initial runs videos that that it could be due to Huff and Puff having over his 60 HP that he has in a normal game and causes him to grow bigger than he's supposed to grow and then you know that causes the game to crash. Um, I don't know if that's how it works for the super boss but it is something to think about. But I think this is what I need. Alright yeah this 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 will work. We'll try this. Yeah let's go. I barely beat him last time. I wouldn't say that. Admittedly, he wasn't the easiest, but... Okay, so 15 damage, and then we'll throw in a fan smack. Okay, just let them kill me. do that very easily. Excellent. Let's see if Puff and Puff attacks now. No? Oh, Alright, so we can just abuse this. Excellent. Am I over out of FP or- Oh, <laughs> wait. <laughs> I forgot. Oh shit. I forgot to, um. Forgot to use the heart block after I put on the FP pluses. Alright, you know, let's. We'll, we'll roll with this. We'll see if I can still beat him. How many life streams do I have? I have three. Alright, we're gonna use um, refresh. And then we'll use fan smack. I'm 
probably actually not going to use Fan Smack. Again. It costs 2 FP. I wonder if I'm going to do enough damage. <laughs> Got two life trims left, I think. One life trim now, right? Okay. Ooh, ooh, this is gonna be close. This is gonna be really close. That's my last life room. I think I should just be able to manage it. It. Oh shoot, but he's gonna heal now, isn't he? Ooh. Uh, alright. I feel like Shellot's gonna crash the game, but... You know, at this point, what does it matter? Does this attack the partner? I forget. I think this does stun Mario, though. No, it just... It just does that. Okay, um... What I don't know is if I'm gonna be able to survive the rough puff attack. I'm gonna focus, I'm gonna let him hit me. Hopefully he doesn't attack again, because now I'm in peril. All right, I think we're good. I heard there's a problem with Wat Bo finishing him. I think that was the problem, so I'm just gonna use Paracarry here. Okay, that was getting close. All right, granted, because I messed up, I'm not. Healing FP at the beginning, but no, 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 we're we're good. I I beat him. We're good now. <laughs> okay. So basically, because you can abuse the fact that he can't heal, or not heal, but that he can't um, uh, he can't attack or or heal after uh, after you hit him the first time. I mean, after they kill you, the rough puffs kill you. Yeah, makes it, uh, makes it very easy to win that fight. Um, Tubba Blubba. So, the issue with him... Without life streams, this is going to be tough. Actually, any of these boss fights without life streams are going to be kind of tough. Do something for this fight. I know exactly what I want to do for this fight. So we are actually going to grab some life shrooms, but actually, I should just go this way and get the life shrooms. But there's something else that I wanted to do. Over. All right, let's let's get the life shrooms first. I have enough coins. All right, good.
Okay. Let's grab my life shrooms. No, I didn't actually didn't want to. Well, I guess it doesn't matter with that. Um, all right, we're gonna claim. You know, we're gonna get rid of these super shrooms. I don't. I don't need to be holding on to them in the shop. Nor stopwatch, really. I'm gonna hold on to that though. I think I might have an idea for it. Although there's a stopwatch for sale here. You know what? No, let's let's get rid of it. I do have an idea with the stop for the stopwatch. Um, but we're gonna hold off on that for now. Um, all right, let's get rid of these fire flowers. Cause like, what do I really need them for now? That I can buy once you get once you can start buying snowman dolls. Like, fire flowers for the most part get outclassed. There are a few exceptions to that though, so not totally. And before you ask, no, we are not selling the pebble. It is, it is too good. We must keep it forever. No, no. So, Tubba Blubba. should be enough. In fact, I could try what I'm about to do on a couple of different super bosses. Maybe. Not 100% sure yet if that's what I want to do, but we'll see. Pretty sure there's not a second pretty lucky in the game. Pretty sure there's just one pretty lucky, one lucky day, and one close call. Alright. Also just save state in case the game just crashes randomly and I have to do all that again. Field. I think there's a star piece actually in this main area. Maybe not. Uh, okay. Yep, we're gonna go into the Tubba fight with Peril Mario. That might be a horrible idea, but I'm gonna do it. I don't know what the hell I'm 
singing. It's not this song, that's for sure. Uh, okay, so let's let's see. All right, get rid of that. Um, all right, the FP pluses are good. Uh, group focus is fine, I guess. Uh, I mean, the truth is that. Uh, what I'm about to do. I don't need Power Rush. It could end up coming in handy, but I don't need it for right this second. Um, here we go. Excellent. Could take off one of the flower savers, actually. But no, let's keep it on. Alright. Let's go fight Tubba Blubba. Again. For the last time. We fought his heart. We fought his body and heart. Now we're gonna fight his body and heart again. But. Stronger. Supposedly. All right, Tabo Laba, let's fight. All right, we're gonna start with Bow. Oh yes, the invincible Tabo Laba. Let's let's give him another shot. Twenty-three. Gets plus to attack. All right. See, I need the lucky badges to work now. I don't really desperately need them to work, but it would make this fight a little easier. Okay, good. There we go. He gets his health back. That's fine. Can only get a three cap on him. Um. out of sight again. He's going to do that. Twenty-five. I was ready for the guard with the partner. He gains HP back, which is all fine. All right, Bo, let's finish him. I don't actually need Band Smack for this, but well, I used it, so. All right, that's Tubba Blubba. Tubba, Tubba. All right, now figuring out what the next easiest boss is is going to be a little interesting. So I'm thinking I can do the same exact thing I just did with the Crystal King. And he'll be even easier than, say, the Gooma King or the Cooper Bros would be. So I'm going to try that with the Crystal King. The only thing with the Crystal King... Actually, there really is nothing different with the Crystal King than Tubba Blubba using this strat. Um, he has more HP. That's it. So, And I think he, has, he might have more defense, too. So it might require some more luck. That said should more or less be the same thing so we're gonna we're gonna give this a shot again with the crystal king see if uh see if it works just as well now that said if he kills me at any point what that means is uh there's something else i'd like to try maybe with the crystal king but let, 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 let's do this first we'll try this and uh see what happens oh but you know what i need for the crystal king though I need a uh, spike shield. I probably don't need quick change, except I do. So we're gonna take off FP plus and what would be better, taking off FP plus or taking off? 
Would it be better to take off FP plus, or would it be better to take off one flower saver? Power bounce would still cost one FP. It's out of sight, I'm pretty sure it would cost... No, actually, it won't affect out of sight at... Hold on, no, no, wait, wait. So, put on... Take off the flower saver, put on back on FP plus. Where is it? Yeah, because out of sight will still cost one. Power bounce will still cost one, so... Yeah, FP plus, keep on, flower saver, take off. It did reduce, I have to do this again, which means then I have to go back in here and do this thing again. This is the best way to get into peril, by the way, just, just saying. Alright, so the Crystal King will always do his attack that's supposed to finish you. That can, like, I guess, pierce last stand defense. Oh, yeah, like I said, I think, uh, hold on, hold on. Did I put on, uh, no, I didn't put on, I put on Spike Shield. Where is it? There it is. Okay, so Spike Shield. Okay, let's go fight the Crystal King and see how this goes. I will not underestimate him, don't worry. Yeah, even with everything I have, that's how much damage I'm doing. This isn't really going to work, like... It's not going to work like it worked for Tubba Bubba. He has too much defense. Um, okay, so let's... See, Cooper was the best option as far as damaging him goes. Thing is, if he kills me, then uh, going to be in a little bit of trouble. Alright, let, let's, let's just experiment a little bit here. That does 10 damage, right? Lucky day. And, uh, pretty lucky in all of them. They failed me. I Oh, actually, I know this attack's gonna kill me. Uh, whatever. You know, that's fine. I don't care. Let it kill me. That is base attack. So if he's gonna do 11 damage to me with his freeze attack, that could actually be a problem. He's gonna heal at some point soon, so I don't know if I want to use chill out or not because I want him to still do a certain amount of damage. I'm gonna do nothing. Oh, yeah, of course, now it works. <laughs> now it works. Um, pretty sure it's when he's under 50, he'll heal. So I'm going to not attack him. Alright, so I'm just going to use the jam and jelly. I could always get one now if I need to. Um, we're going to boost Mario's attack, actually. Actually, there's no point, because I don't have Power Rush on. I think I took that off. Oh, wait, I don't have, um, Feeling Fine on. Okay, no, this, this whole, this whole thing's a disaster now. Let me see if he misses. Okay, he missed. Does it always freeze you for... Huh. Yeah, I'm actually gonna use Bow here. We're gonna out of sight this. Or if I use Cooper here. Well, Mario is in peril. 
In fact, you know what? That's actually a great idea. That is actually a great idea. You know what? Screw this. I just had another idea. It's very evil, but you know what? I'm gonna do it. It's gonna be great. And, uh... I just gotta remember, what shop is it? What shop is it I gotta go to? I think it's the Starhaven shop. I might be wrong on that, though. Alright, first I gotta make, uh, make some coins. It's the star... I was just there, too. I don't remember if they have it. Um. At least I know I can run away from um, these embers pretty easily. I think it's pretty easy just to get to 100%. And they don't first strike you, so I don't have to worry about that. How did that one not hit me? You know what the issue is, though? Can't. <laughs> uh, I gotta sell items. Okay, you know what? We're gonna sell these two shooting stars, and I'll get shooting stars if I ever need them again. I'm selling them for nothing, of course. Oh boy, this is what. This is why I should just sell everything. I can buy pretty much any item I want now. Like once I once you unlock this shop. Um, I don't want to claim, I want to... No, I want to, I want to check. Oh, but yeah, I need to claim some items first. Now, what am I going to sell? Uh, Alright, I thought I sold all my fire flowers. I guess I didn't. Alright, let's just sell the snowman's doll. And another snowman doll. And another snowman doll. We're just going to sell all the scrap. Hold on to the shooting stars for as long as we can. I need to I'll just buy some more. You know, what I'm about to do is really evil. It's just not right. But it's going to be exact damage. It's going to be exact FP usage. And I'm going to use all my items. And it's like gonna be Mario at 1 HP at the end of it, so, like, this is something Cappy, I think, would approve of. Uh, let's see, though. That wouldn't surprise me if somebody already thought of this. Uh, what else am I gonna sell? I guess I'll sell the Shooting Stars now. Like, I don't wanna sell the Ultra Shrooms. Oh, Maple Syrup. What the hell is that doing here? Uh, the dried fruits, we'll start selling them too. Another snowman doll. Another dried fruit. Uh... 
Um, the only other thing to really sell would be the shooting stars. I'm, I'm not selling the pebble. There's no way that's happening. Uh, so, I'm going to sell the shooting stars. Got a lot of life shrooms. I'm not going to need them for this next fight, but... Uh, I mean, I'm just gonna check. I can check 11. Excellent. I'm gonna check all of this. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Oh shit, wait, 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 wait. There's one thing I gotta do. I mean, it would... Well, nah. let's just do this. Alright, um... Yeah, these all don't really matter. Keep on these, just in case. But, the rest of this is fine. Take that off. We're gonna put on another FP plus. And then we're gonna buy that jam and jelly. It's been 75 coins just to use it to get my FP back, so I don't have to use a heart block, and then I have to go back to Flower Fields to, you know, do that again. All right, cool. We're set. In fact, I actually know that what I'm about to do wouldn't really work well in, um, in later versions of this. Because, obviously, you can tie every repel gels. The idea is to get Crystal King to miss, always use his one attack, never heal, and then finish him with Cooper in ten turns. Which I have just enough FP for when I also put on... Um, that's right, I have to take off uh, Spike Shield. I almost forgot the other part of this. And put on... Um, second flower saver. That'll bring Cooper's fire shell attack down to 2 FP. So it'll be 10 attacks of that, 20 turns. 10 turns, repel gels, fire shell, that's going to be that. Now, this won't, now this wouldn't work exactly in, like I said, the later versions of this because Crystal King, I think he heals like 30 HP when he misses an attack for whatever reason. So, yeah, this, uh, this is something that I have the version for that it'll still work on. And it shouldn't happen, by the way, so it's good that it was patched, but... Yeah, still. I'm, I have it, so I'm gonna use it. We're gonna do it. In fact, somebody probably did this exact thing, and that's why it was patched to begin with. But, uh... Alright, so we got Cooper. We got all the badges I need. Save stated. Let's go. Okay, repel gel, and then fire shell. And then he attacks. We get another repel gel. I mean, I'll use this time as well to explain as far as, like, updating this game goes. I am planning to update this at some point, And then do a whole run. 
with the updated version, but I think I've explained it before too. I, I've to update it, it's kind of a process for me. Because unfortunately the Star Red Patcher or Java or something doesn't work on my main computer, so I have to set up my old computer to do that, so it's just a real pain. So at some point I'm gonna update it, hopefully when it's like at its final version. And uh this way I don't have to keep updating it. I mean, I don't know if there's ever going to be, like, a true final version or not. I mean, I'm sure at some point there will be, but I don't know how long it's going to be. <laughs> but, uh, but yeah, so eventually I will update it and experience the game in its most current form. Oh shit, it's not exact FP usage. Oh wait, no it is, it is, because Fire Shell does too, right. Okay, good. See? Exact FP usage, exact number of items, all items used, and Mario's at 1 HP. Again, this is a Cappy approved strat, I'm pretty sure. I think. I don't know, you'd have to ask him if he ever sees it. Uh, so, let's... What am I gonna do now? Alright, let's heal up. Alright, those are the first two super bosses. I think that's good for one part. Um, those are like... I'm sorry, those are three. I did three of them. Um, so those are like the three easy ones. I mean, Goomba King and Koopa Bros, they're coming up next. And, uh... Maybe Final Bowser comes up next, too? I think Final Bowser is easier than, uh... Well, I Toon and Koopa is, I think, probably the most difficult. Lava Piranha is... can be pretty difficult, too. And, uh, I heard Lava Prana is going to get nerfed, actually. And... This guy. Um... General Guy. General Guy is interesting. I Once I found out what I had to do, it was pretty easy, but apparently it's not that consistent. And I just got lucky with it, so we're going to see that. Honestly, General Guy would probably come up next, maybe, but I'm going to go for the for the Koopa Bros and, uh, and Goomba King next. And then maybe General Guy after that. And then we jump into... Bowser, which... Bowser's not really that difficult. It's just a very long fight. Like, a very long fight. Um, at least he wasn't difficult in the normal run of this, but with Luigi's Challenge and low HP and everything, he might end up being pretty dang difficult, especially when you can't really abuse life streams that you have to have low HP, unless you use HP pluses, which may be what I do, but, well, I'll see when I get to that. Um... So Bowser, I don't know if Bowser's going to come up in the next part. Maybe General Guy. I feel like General Guy would be easier than Lava Piranha, but I'm not 100% sure. So I'll think about it, and then I'll figure it out, and then, well, I'll see you then.